Welcome to Endless Learning Training Series The Membrane-Based Desalination Technology. In this presentation we will study why we need airburst system at seawater intake screen in SWRO plant, airburst system crucial role. What is an airburst system? Airburst system is a technology used in SWRO desalination plants to prevent and manage fouling, scaling, and biological growth on equipment and surfaces, particularly those exposed to water. Working principle, it works by generating bursts of compressed air to create shock waves and turbulence that dislodge and prevent the accumulation of unwanted materials. Screens made of copper and nickel I wedge wires with a clearance of about 3 mm. Both ends of the screens can be opened by hinged covers for cleaning purposes also from inside. The screens have connections for chlorination and air burst. Key components of an air burst system typically include air compressors, air receiver valves, distribution pipelines, and strategically placed nozzles or diffusers near the intake screens. The air burst system is sized adequately for the screens and consists of 2x 100% air compressor, an air receiver vessel. Air burst starts can be activated by operator or automatically with time interval. Air burst is performed alternately on screen A and B. When activated, the air compressors release compressed air through the nozzles creating shock waves and turbulence in the vicinity of the intake screens. These shock waves dislodge fouling materials and prevent their accumulation, while the turbulence deters the attachment of marine organisms and the precipitation of minerals. These shock waves dislodge fouling materials and prevent their accumulation, while the turbulence deters the attachment of marine organisms and the precipitation of minerals, intake screen before and after. Airburst system crucial role for seawater intake screen, airburst system at the seawater intake screen in an SWR, seawater reverse osmosis, plant is essential for several reasons. Fouling prevention, seawater intake screens are designed to prevent debris, aquatic organisms, and suspended solids from entering the SWRO system. Over time, these screens can become fouled with organic matter, silt, algae, and marine growth. An airburst system helps dislodge and remove fouling, ensuring the intake screens remain clear and effective. Scaling prevention, scaling occurs when dissolved minerals in seawater, such as calcium and magnesium, precipitate onto the intake screens. Scaling can lead to reduced flow rates and increased energy consumption. Maintaining flow rates, Fouled intake screens can reduce the flow of seawater into the SWRO plant, leading to decreased productivity and efficiency. An airburst system helps maintain optimal flow rates, ensuring that the plant can operate at its designed capacity. Maintenance frequency and costs, without an airburst system, Regular maintenance and cleaning of intake screens would be necessary to prevent fouling. An airburst system reduces the frequency of manual cleaning and maintenance, saving time and labor costs. Energy efficiency Reduced fouling and improved flow rates result in better energy efficiency. 
A clean and unobstructed intake screen requires less energy to pump seawater into the SWRO system, contributing to lower operational costs. Extended screen lifespan, frequent cleaning and maintenance can cause wear and tear on intake screens. An airburst system minimizes the need for physical cleaning, which can extend the lifespan of the screens and reduce replacement costs. Extended membrane lifespan, fouling and scaling on intake screens can lead to increased stress on the SWRO membranes. Maintaining clean screens can extend the lifespan of the expensive reverse osmosis membranes, reducing replacement costs. Operational reliability, an airburst system enhances the overall reliability of the SWRO plant. It minimizes the risk of unexpected downtime due to fouling-related issues and ensures a continuous supply of seawater. Biological growth management Airburst technology disrupts and manages biological growth by creating a hostile environment for marine organisms. The shockwaves and turbulence created by the system deter the attachment and settlement of biofouling organisms on the intake screens. Thank you for watching this video.